Hi guys, welcome in. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I'll be reading The Remarried Empress, episode 153. Due to what I'm going to follow a new policy, I do have to blur 50% of each episode. So yes, cat logo's going up or else my channel will be get taken down. Let's get started. The shopping district in the Eastern Empire's capital. St st uh. Navier? Ding. Welcome. Huh. The journalist. Right? That's a journalist? The man's trying to look unassuming, but I can tell he's someone important. Making a fuss over him would do more harm than good. Right this way. Uh, master. I'm fine. Oh, I know who it is now. Okay, <laughs> I dirt. I would like to buy this painting. That piece wasn't meant to be for sale. I must warn you, it's pretty expensive. Are you still interested? I don't care how much it costs. One day in spring, when it was barely windy and not too hot, Navier and I went on a picnic in the palace in the garden. I was lying down like that, and like, I was lying down like in that painting. And whenever I teased her, she'll tug my hair accidentally. Navier was ticklish, so she eventually burst out laughing. But why? Why isn't she looking at me? Navier, Navier, I miss you. I wish you would return. Please, Navier. The Remarried Empress, episode 153. Side note, that made me cringe really, really, really hard because personal life here, my ex that I broke up with for over three years now still does that he is so obsessed with me that he would go through his old emails and stuff like old text message or whatever and he would like email those screenshots over to me like, i miss you i will always love you and all this stuff and i would like dude move on like move on it's been three years you've been in a with in a, a new relationship since like i dumped him a month and a month after that like i dumped him and then a month later, he's in a new relationship and was in that relationship for a while now. So I was like, dude, you should focus on your your new relationship. Stop dr missing me. Like, it's gone. I'm not going back. Dude, please give me another chance. I was like, no. And he would stalk me and stuff. So that, so Beishu and my ex, just ugh. Ugh. Move on. Obsess obsession really, really is scary. The next morning, Miss Labetti has been safely rescued. Good work. The, the drawer, that drawer contains all of Russia's misdeeds. That's a lot, at least the ones I know of. Where's Rasta? Ra where's Rasta? Her Majesty has a stomach ache, is unable to make it here. That bird must still bother her. I'll pay her a visit. Also, have the court artists come by sometime soon. I have a job that I need done. You've been having a lot of stomach troubles. Don't hesitate to call for the palace physician. Even for the slightest discomfort. That's why he's here. Uh, all right. He's being nice today for once. By the way, your majesty, you haven't sung in a while. Our child would love to hear their father sing. <sighs> His eyes it has been very dark and very, like, very sulky, very, like, sullen, like, you know, dark, tired. 
Is there anything you'd like to tell me? No, there's nothing. Are you sure? Take a moment to think. Uh, why the interrogation? Lately, I've done quite a few things I'd rather he not know about. But there's no need to confess to such a big question. I have nothing to share. What about you? Don't you have something to tell me? Not really, but you look like you have a bone to pick with me. What about this? What's that tacky trinket? Huh? Is, is this not what you gave to Evelyn when you made her your mistress? You insult my taste. <gasps> anyway, I assume this belongs to Evelyn. Did you steal it? I, I found it somewhere. I didn't give it back because I don't like you paying attention to other women. I'll return it. <laughs> Meanwhile, in the Western Empire. Yum. <laughs> this is the most delicious omelet I've ever eaten. Have a bite. <sighs> I need to make up for a few things, and Henry's always doing nice things for me. So I thought cooking would be a great way to thank him. But this is more of a soup than an omelette. My queen was wrong. I just don't have much of an appetite. Oh no, you're a bit warm. Shall I call for the palace physician? No, it's alright. Anyway, I heard you found out that why the merchant group was detained. Ah, oh, yes. McKenna was right. They suspected that we had a privateer disguised as a merchant to ship to invade them. Privateer, an armed and state-sanctioned ship that loops ships from other countries. We have to make sure they know it's a misunderstanding. You seem happy, though. <laughs> McKenna said the same thing. Is it that obvious? I just... <laughs> I was just thinking that... It would be nice to have our own port. Okay. Well, a lot kind of happened in this episode. So, of course, Rashta did get interrogated um, a bit by Sobeshu. I was, I thought the first, you know, panel was uh, the journalist, but actually Sobeshu came in and purchased the painting or the photo of him with Navier back in the day. And it kind of like, yeah, it's sweet that he did. But also at the same time, it's like, hey, it took you to lose someone to value them. Like, you really don't deserve that person. And it made me cringe. Rashta, of course, did not fess up what she did. But hey, she thought she was slick. But hey, but Savetia already knows what she's been doing. Not Maybe not all of it, but most of it so far. From that drawer, that's a lot of stuff that she's been doing that's very sinful uh and uh, for her to be jealous with a necklace was like why did you give her this and i don't remember who gave her that necklace like evely i think it was rushed i'm uh, not rushed i'm um, navier never gave her that or one of the mages i don't know it was uh it's supposed to it's like a man no henry was it henry i need a reread some part because I remember like someone gave Evely that to help with her mana issues huh but anyways uh slowly kind of learning more about uh what Henry and Navier has to do on the professional side as you know running the kingdom or I mean the empire so so far so good but Rashta part is getting pretty Pretty spicy. It's gonna get piping hot where she's gonna be in a lot of trouble. Alright guys, if you guys enjoyed the way I read this and react to this webtoon, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, and of course, check out my Patreon page, which is at patreon.com slash ckt chaotic.